Hello everyone, this is Kevin Her, Entrepreneur and British Labour politician Rebecca Long Bailey has officially come out and said she does not feel it is moral to use Uber. Now, for those of you who do not understand who she is or do not know, you can Google her name. Um, I did and it was actually quite impressive. But she's basically someone who fights for the labor rights of workers. And she was quoted as saying she does not personally use Uber because of the way they treat the workers. And she also considers the drivers part of the workers, not just the people who work at the offices. Now, it's interesting. She didn't say this about Lyft, probably because, as most of us know, while Lyft is not priced any better than Uber and they, um, well, they seem to follow them tit for tat. It's always, hey, when Uber cuts the price, then Lyft cuts the price. When Uber makes this change, then Lyft makes that changes. Lyft rocked before Uber started changing the prices and everything, and then they sucked. So they were still better to use. Figure that one out. Um, and this comment comes before she's going to launch a report about modern day economics and how employees are treated by the modern day companies. So if she's actually bad mouthing Uber before she releases the report, it's under my impression we're going to hear a lot more about what she doesn't like about Uber very, very, very soon. And that is going to be a very fascinating read. I think I'm going to have a lot of fun reading it. I'm going to have a lot of fun talking about it here. And this also comes off a very strenuous time because, as you know, Uber is particularly suffering in the European countries. Because while many of the complaints over there are the same as they are over in America, they seem willing to do something about it. And Uber's losing, you know, licenses, they're being fined, things are being told to get out. And it's just kind of a culture thing. Over there in European countries, Europe is rejecting Uber. And, uh, who knows, maybe Uber's new CEO, if they should ever actually hire one, can fix those tenuous relationships. I have no idea. I have no idea if they'll be able to do that. We're just going to have to see. But until then, this is a pretty good snapshot of what politicians over there think about Uber, and it's not good. And if you ever wonder why they're getting fined so much money, and they're losing a lot of ground, and they're not being allowed to stay, it's because people like Rebecca, frankly, just don't like them. And they're not going to work with them until they like them. So anyway, that's the news story for that. What do you folks think? Um, do you agree with her? Do you disagree with her? I would love to know. Comment below, like, favorite, share, subscribe. If you enjoy the videos I make, consider becoming a Patreon member or buying some swag from the Great Media Universe store. If you want to try driving for Uber and Lyft, while you still can in Europe, use the referral link below. You'll get a nice little bonus. And as always, flame responsibly. Have a good one.